very best Like no one ever was Hello humans! If you're new here, my name is Dale Kingsmill and I'm a big nerd about lots of big nerdy things. Earlier this week, a package arrived for me in the mail. A package which contained my new t-shirts, hooray! My new t-shirts which I ordered nearly a month ago. Remember that curse I mentioned a couple of weeks ago? The, the buying things online curse that I have? Yeah, came into play again. But either way, my fancy new Pokemon t-shirt included in this package reminded me that I used to play Pokemon Red, Pokemon Yellow, Pokemon Blue on my Game Boy all the time. Like, it was, it was a staple game of my childhood, but I never once actually finished it. I don't even mean, like, completing the Pokedex and doing all the time. I'm talking just, you know, even making it to the Pokemon League. I mean, you get to those parts in the middle where you're just walking around for ages. I just want to be able to go to the gyms without having to do other stuff in between. Could I please ignore Team Rocket until I have to fight that one guy? That, that'd that be great. And the caves, the stupid caves, oh my word. But I always wanted to beat all the gym leaders and make it to the Pokemon League. So this realization kind of spurred me to go and make another attempt, another run at it. But uh, the game crashed and I lost everything, so I had to start again, again. But I'm filming some of it for you now. It's uh, much later on when the Pokemon are actually kind of good at stuff. Also, just so that you know, I took a leaf out of uh, Gordon from Ikifu and Jesse from Fifty Shades of Fandom's book, and I named all of my Pokemon after my friends from the Geek and Sundry Vlogger family. So... <laughs> I mean, I think it makes it more entertaining. Yeah, Pokemon Red! While we're here, I may as well just show you the gang. Show you the gang. Ovs, we have Kiri the badass bee creature. See, this is Kiri here, who I chose to be Beedrill because I figured if anyone wouldn't mind spending time as a crap hairy bug or an awkward cocoon, as long as I got to be a badass bee wasp thing, It'd be Kiri. All right, just gonna make a quick trip all the way back up to frickin' Cerulean. Woo! Look at me, I'm a madman! Woo! Woo! Oh gosh, I missed the thing. Oh, and now I'm fighting while on a bike. I can't be the only one who thought these were hedges, right? Right? Yes, my Tumulty. I wonder what Pokemon could be named after Scott. Yeah, sure, I love Pokemon. They're great. Oh, oh, okay, we're fighting. You've seen my ticket. I've come through here so many times. You must recognize my face by now. I'm glad there are sailors all over this boat though, because I mean, I've got flippin' Amy and Monarch. Amy, my lovely Pikachu, who hopefully someday soon will be a fancy pantsy Raichu. Fancy pants. Amy got to be the Pikachu because she has lightning bolts on her on her icon, on her Geek and Sundry icon. Yeah, damn straight it failed. Monarch, my beloved Ivysaur. My starter is my is my Bulbasaur. I felt bad because no one ever picks Bulbasaur, so I went for Bulbasaur. Holland, my brand spanking new Abra. Aha! The old trick, eh? Switching out the Pokemon that you had in first so that they get experience without actually doing any fighting. Oh, good on you, Holland. <gasps> this is terrible. This is truly awful. It's just that it's so much walking. I mean, I guess that's good for flippin' Tumulty's growth back at the babysitters, but I just, I need to not have to walk so far to get stuff, is basically what I'm saying. We can take this guy. His sailor pride is at stake, guys. She's only missing to play up for the camera, I swear. Oh no, it's because I'm fighting a damn Pidgey. Stinking Pidgeys. Why, why, no, why do you keep getting to do things? Mitch, my Spiro, soon to be Firo, hopefully. Ouch. Ooh. Yes, finally Hyper Fang. Give me the Hyper Fang. Tiger Chimp, who will look much less scrawny once he's eradicate, I swear. There weren't enough characters for Tiger Monkey. You're damn straight, you paralyzed. But, you know, not much. Quit withdrawing. Now watch as I walk all the way back again. Again. Dude, dude, dude. Come on. You know me. Amanda. Amanda McGuinness. 
Actually, it's not Amanda McGuinness anymore, congratulations, by the way, on the wedding. Actually, Amanda kicked butt at Misty's gym. It was pretty intense. What does the nugget do? Probably lots of you who are more experienced at the Pokemon games are shouting answers at me that I don't know and I can't hear you because this is pre-recorded. Getting that mystery item. Ciao. Oh, that's good. Hey, 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 hey. You stop that. Rudo. I didn't want to pick favorites when naming <laughs> the Pokemon that was basically going to be the best Pokemon for the entire early section of the game. So I decided the only safe way was to favoritize myself. So now the trainer is Kingsy, named after me, and the Ivysaur is Monarch, also named after me. Yay, Holland. Dead. Dead is you. I like the way it just says what. What do you want? I have been wasting TMs like a champ since the last game crashed because, I mean, what's the point if you're just gonna lose all the progress anyway? You never get to use them, you're never gonna have any fun. Butter slam. Yeah! Down you go! Oh, this music is driving me crazy. Giving my stuff to the PC, giving all my stuff to the... PC over here. That was beautiful. Yep, that's fine that there's no more room for this Pokemon because if he's only grown by six levels, that would make Tumulty a level 11 Magikarp. That's right, Scott. You're a Magikarp. I made you a Magikarp. No, 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 no. Damn it! Well then. Yep, it crashed again. I'm gonna have to start again. Again. <laughs> oh goody. In other news, look what else arrived in the mail. Woo! I think I just heard everything tip out of its place, but I got it! Yeah! Yeah, Betrayal seemed to be the most recommended in the comments on my video that I did on which board game should I buy and why is it so hard? So thank you everyone for your recommendations. I got so many other good suggestions as well and now I just want more board games. I don't know if it makes my dilemma better or worse, really. I choose to believe better. Played a bunch of games last night and it was super fun, although maybe not a great idea to be playing it at 1am when I'm such a scaredy cat. I may or may not have gone to sleep with a hockey stick next to me. Anywho, let me know in the comments what your favorite Pokemon from the original 151. That's right, we're talking first generation. When I was a kid, it was definitely Charmander. I would really appreciate it if you could hit the like button and also the share button. And I feel like you should probably not email this one to your grandma. Unless, I mean, unless your grandma is a Pokemon fan. That'd be really cool. Go your grandma. But I don't know, maybe email it to your little cousin. Your, your, Pokemon fan little cousin or something instead of your grandma. That is it. I am done and I will see you guys some other time. All my Pokemon shirts are in the wash today. Getting dressed for this video this morning I found out that all of my Pokemon shirts are in the wash. Granted I only have two but still.